Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're looking for an overnight non-phone work from home job with no calls, no customer service, and beginner friendly option, then you need to know about becoming a data annotator, also called an AI training data reviewer. This is one of the fastest growing remote careers for 2025. And the best part, you can do it overnight, quietly, and without a degree. In this video, I am breaking down what the job is, the daily duties, the skills you need, the equipment training, pros and cons, where to find jobs, resume keywords, how to apply, and beginner tips. Plus, I share some affirmation to keep you motivated on your journey. So you may ask the question, what is a data annotator? Okay, we're going to go in there. A data annotator is someone who helps train artificial intelligence systems. AI can only learn when human, humans label information for it thinks like, like identifying objects in photos, correcting tax, text, tagging videos, and then also categorizing content and rating response, labeling emotions or intent and comments. AI needs millions of examples to become accurate, and that's where you come in. You're, ba you're basically the human behind the algorithm telling the AI what's correct and what's not. This work is quiet and perfect for night owls. Now, you may ask, what are the daily job duties? The daily task depends on the project, Jack, but usually include labeling image or objects tagging videos or short clips, rating AI generating response, categorizing text into topics, checking grammar or accuracy of AI answers, reviewing social media content, labeling audio or transcribing short clips, sorting data into spreadsheets. Most companies give you a dashboard, task pop-up, and you complete them at your own pace, Perfect for late night owls. Now, the skills you need. You don't need techno experience, but these skills help. Strong attention to detail. Good reading comprehensive. Basic typing skills. Ability to follow instructions. Patient for uh, task. Comfortable working alone. Basic computer knowledge. And you need to be organized focus, and can sit for a long period, you'll do great, okay? Now, the equipment you need, okay, for this position here, or this job title, a laptop or desktop, Mac or Windows, reliable internet, quiet workspace, Google Chrome browser, sometimes a webcam for identifying verification, that's it, no fancy software needed. Training, where to get training? You can start with free or low cost training to learn the basics. The free training, of course, like I always say, is YouTube University. They have plenty of YouTube tutorials, Google's AI Essentials, Canva AI Bases, Open AI uh, Educational Resource. And then if you're talking about the course itself, Udemy, Coursera, and Skillshare. Most companies train you on their platform anyway, so experience is helpful, but not required. Now we're going to go over the pros and cons, okay? We need to know that. We need to keep this real because you need to know what the pros and cons of this position. The pros of this job title, no phone calls, beginner friendly, great for an introvert, flexible hours, including overnight, quiet work, companies hired globally. Now the cons, some projects can be slow, Pay varies by task, can be repetitive, workability may fluctuate. Still, it's one of the best entry-level remote job for 2025. Where can you work, okay? Here are the top companies hiring data annotators and AI reviews. It is on the screen, as you can see. Look it, stop, make copies, take a picture of it. And like I say, take a picture of me. <laughs> but here it is right here on the screen here that you will see um, the AI trainers 
um, in, in these companies here. So take advantage of those. Okay, it's right here listed here. Okay, most offer flexible project base where you can do overnight. Okay, so we're gonna go over resume keywords. I talk about this all the time. Is resume is very important here because you do have to go through the ATS system. And if I was looking or want to apply for this job title, these are the same. These are some of the keywords that I would put in my resume: data and notions, AI training, content tagging, quality assurance, data labeling, image clarifications, text categorization, content moderations, analytical skills, attention to details. This make your resume ATS friendly. And how to succeed in this position? You need to follow instruction exactly. Take your time. Accuracy matters more than speed. Stay consistent with task quality. Keep your workspace distraction free. Log in during off peak times. Overnight has more tasks. Small improvements add up. Now how to start as a beginner if you wanna get into it here. And this is what we're going to go over so you know how to get into it. Here's how to start if you've never done this before. Create a free account on two to three companies. Complete qualification tests. Start on small, easy tasks. Track your accuracy. Move up to higher paying projects. Consistency is the key. And how to apply and follow up. When applying, keep your resume simple. Keep your resume simple. Highlight attention to details. List any online training. Take qualification tests seriously. If you don't hear back, wait to 7, 10 days. Check your email spam folder. Follow up once through the platform. Most companies contact you when a project's open. Now, I want to give you some encouragement words or affirmation because, like I said, we need some encouragement words. We're all going through the storms of life, okay? If you never experience like the older generation say, baby, keep on living, you're going to experience. You got to go through the storms in order to see the rainbow. So I'm going to do some read some affirmation, and I want you to just read this. It's going to be listed on the screen, too, as well. I am capable of learning new skills. Remote work is possible for me. I deserve flexibility and stability. Every step I take brings me closer to my goals. I am building a better future for myself. I got this. Keep going. Now, I want to say it again in case you didn't hear it. I am capable of learning new skills. Remote work is possible for me. I deserve flexibility and stability. Every step I take brings me closer to my goals. I am building a better future for myself. You got this. Keep going. Now, if this video has been helpful thus far, I want you to hit that like button as well as subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notifications so every time when a new video go out, you will be notified and be able to watch this video. Subscribe to the channel, share, and I want you to comment below and let me know if this is if this job title is something that you will be willing to pursue. Let me know in the comment section. I want you to know, hey, you got this. You will find what you're seeking real soon. Trust the process. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.